I'm Tom Aioli from Celebrity Motor Car Company, and I'm Bruin Solutions on a daily basis. These guys are amazing. You need to watch them. Their podcast is absolutely amazing, and I'm honored to be a part of it. This brew has been brought by Think Ad Group. You can get your information at thinkadgroup.com. Get you some. So we got one more question on That's this right. liner, folks. Sure. And I want to make sure that we get deep on this answer, Tom. I want to I want to know because you've had many great successes, right? And we just talked about reading the field on a football field and, you know, on the football field, ultimately everybody wants to score the goal. And right. we encourage everybody to write down your goals, create your goals, aim at your goals, shoot past your goals. And you, sir, have experienced failures, have had hard lessons, but have also achieved some great things that many people would stop at just one of the great things that you've achieved, right? They'd be they'd find a comfort level and coast on with life. You've constantly, constantly went to the next level, to the next level. And you're still doing so today. Mm. Can't wait to see what the next years bring uh, and the awesomeness that comes from them. But all of this time, what has been to you the greatest reward of all of the things that you've seen come together so far inside of your serial entrepreneur career? Mm. The greatest reward. Mm, that, hit that chest again. We're trying to get deep. <laughs> you know that's a very interesting question, but I think I think the the you know the greatest reward that I have achieved clearly I've made a lot of money, right? And that and that's kind of a trophy. That's you know not, after a while it pays the bills, but then it becomes a trophy. And and but the greatest re reward that I have achieved is to be able to lead by example and have my own daughter. You know, go to, go to college wow. and, and major in entrepreneurship with a minor in business and get out and with the goals of doing real estate development, which we've already started projects together and, and wanting to follow in those footsteps. So, so she learned by example and, and, you know, that's one of my greatest successes is that she, you know, is, 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 and my other child's just about to go to college and she's learned by example. When I talk to her, even my younger one, it's, you know, it's, they don't have this desire in life to just sit back and do nothing and not achieve. They, they want greater than, and it's not greed. It's greater than because they want to create and they want to create, you know, jobs for other people and lives for other people and, 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 and pass that on. That, that, that would be my greatest success. That, I mean, it's just, you know, it's, it's, it, to me, it's just absolutely amazing. That's, Tom, man, we are so on the same frequency, brother. I love it. We are, no doubt about it. By the way, causes me to not ever want to stop because it's so it's so gratifying to yes. be able to, you know, not only help your own children. I mean, you know, your own your own children are following in your footsteps. They're learning from you, and 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 they're learning by just by example by watching, and 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 then to have other people, and and you know, and and you know, that want to do the same thing. It's, it's, it's just amazingly gratifying, but that, that would be really my biz, biggest success is, is the, what I have instilled in my two daughters. Tom, the legacy is key. We, we, yeah. I, I will preach that till I'm blue in the face. I am so grateful for the opportunity to be sowing seeds that will grow trees yeah. that I will never have the chance to enjoy the shade of. That's right. Okay. You know and, I, I've taught both of them from day one. I said, you know what? Listen, there's, there's the most important thing is is in life is to respect yourself and to respect others. I said, you know what? You treat the person who cleans your bathroom the same way you treat the person that's managing your company. Mm -hmm. That's man. This is that's great. Guys, this is a solutionary, a solutionaries, works. folks. Tom Mayoli here on the Car Guy Coffee Podcast, letting you know inside of the echo that other guests have said. Yeah. Legacy is the greatest reward. Knowing yeah. that something is going to continue wow. on that you have sown into is, is just what is so gratifying when all of the other fluff and stuff goes away. We, we have some great things, right? Tom has yeah. some awesome stuff. 
and, been, and, been, and you know, one of the lesson in, the, in that process, I have to go back to that because because it's so inspiring. Is you know, when I say you treat the person who cleans your bathroom the same way you treat you know the person who runs your company, that, that's just out of general respect for people. And but then you take it to a whole nother level, and that is that you know when I was in the logistics business, I, I befriended a person who worked in a, in a company who became the manager of a logistical department in a company and brought me in. And, 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 and I won million dollar, multi-million dollar accounts. Well, it, it gets even better. That person was so successful. He went from, from one company. <laughs> He, he wound up going to another company, to another company, to another company. He wound up at five different companies and every company he went to, he brought my company in to do the logistics business. It was, it was, you know, 20, 30, 50 million dollars worth of business over the years that came mm. from one relationship. Wow. That's, again, that's another way of looking at a legacy, you know, and that's exactly cool. right. It's, it's, cool. a, oh, it's one handshake in the other. You gave a great service. So which helped him look really good at where he was at, which helped him get positions at all these other places. He goes there, he brings you in again. And does it for himself. It's awesome. You know, that's a great team. You know, it's somebody that you had that's uh, that you can meet with. And, get, man, that's amazing. That's a great story. That really is. Tom Maioli is here with us, folks. And we're going to echo again the importance of not judging people and their motives, not that's judging right. people that's and right. what it is that you think you know about them. But you judge a man by their fruit. And Tom Maioli has some great fruit inside mm-hmm. of his life. And he can look at his his children. He can look at his daughter and see that there are many seeds that are going to be sown from that one piece of fruit that he's brought to this world and the many other people that he's built relationships from. Yes. Folks, we encourage you to continue to flourish. This is Lou Ramirez, the car guy. And this is Fred Arts, the subprime hero. And we are here with Tom Maioli. That's and right. we're going to be back with some fresh news right after this.